Hey, look who we got. Hello. Yeah, we might show you these later on. Yeah, what's that, Cameron? Hey, look at that. Emus. Hey? It'll be several months before the emus are old enough to live at the sanctuary. Good boy, good boy. For now, they'll start their new life yeah. in the laundry room of Brolga and Tawny's house. Your new home. All right, I'm just gonna make sure they it. get outside. How are you gonna hold it open? I'm just gonna hold it like oh, this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you mean to hold it open? No, hey. no, that'd be good, that'd be good. good. And we'll just, uh... Oh, that's good. Yeah. <laughs> now it's a shh, just be very quiet. Here it comes, oh, look at that. Hi. Oh, oh, they're magic. They're so tall. Yeah, a little bit bigger than I thought they might be. Emus are Australia's largest flightless bird, and these chicks will eventually reach the height of a fully grown man, capable of running at speeds of nearly 30 miles an hour. I was so worried that they were going to panic and yeah. run everywhere yeah. and smash into the wall. and they're sticking to each other. Yeah. This is the way they communicate with each other, which is... So if they're all whistling, they're happy because they're all together. Oh, they're all, they? Yeah, yeah, they that's must great. feel safe or yeah. something like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. that's yeah. fantastic. Oh, I'm so glad we got them. I, I knew it was the right thing to do. You'll keep them just in here tonight, just to settle them down? I, 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 think it, I think it's worthwhile. They're together, they've got the reassurance of each other, and they're not going to run around madly. The brush would give them something to peck at, um, also give them the yeah. feeling of security like going under a bush, that's a heat lamp, and yeah. Big Ted to give them something to cuddle up to. Maybe, yeah, yep. yeah, yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? You've only been in here five minutes and you're destroying the place already. The next day, Brolga lets the emus explore their surroundings. Come on. Although flightless, these birds do have small wings, they use their wings as stabilizers when they run. Having the emus in the house is chaos. They are falling over, getting up, falling on the floorboards, chasing each other. It's, it's great fun, but it is a chaotic house with the emus inside. Because the house is clearly unsuitable, Brolga moves the emus to a small enclosure in his backyard where he can keep a close eye on them. 